Plano, Texas. I mean, if you were to know about a city here in DFW, you need to know about Plano. Plano has everything and Plano is a highly sought out area because of the school districts and because of the types of housing that you get here and because of the people that live here. If you are interested in Plano, the average sales price of a home right now in February of 2023 is $513,000. In this week's video, I'm going to show you what you can get for so close to that average sales price house. We're going to go a little under, we're going to go right smack dab on it and we're going to go a little bit higher than the average sales price house. So if Plano interests you and that is your budget, then this is the video for you. So stick around. Hey everyone, my name is Danae Hewitt and I am your go-to DFW Realtor with Brico Realty Services. On my channel, I talk to you about all the things real estate. I get into the contracts and what everything means. And then I also go around to different cities here in DFW to show you what type of home you can get for your money. And this is gonna be one of those videos. I am in Plano today and it is a gorgeous day. We kind of had a gloomy weekend the last couple of days. So it's really nice to be outside. No clouds in the sky. It's absolutely beautiful. I am at a local park right now and I'm gonna show you what kind of a home you can get for the $500,000 price point. The homes that I'm going to show you today are very similar in age and amenities, but they're in different parts of, of the city here. But I do hope to point out a little bit of the differences that each of the homes has for you to better help you make your decision if this is the place you are planning to relocate to. All right, let's get going. We are at house number one, and this house is listed under the average sales price here in Plano at $490,000. But I've got a surprise for you about this house. It's four bedrooms, three bathrooms with a two car garage and a pool. It's got 2,109 square feet, ranch style, single story home. So this, on this neighborhood here, I really like the neighborhood if you're just definitely into those older homes. This home was built in 1976. I'll tell you that this, these streets aren't that wide, which wasn't maybe a thing that they did in the 70s, make wide streets. Yeah, I don't know. So if you had friends, neighbors coming to, coming to stay, it would be a little, probably a little crammed. I mean, cars would certainly have to go around the parked cars that came to see you. As you can tell with this house, they have done some updating in those hardwood floors. They've got nice neutral paint throughout the house. They've done some updating. It probably happened 10 to 15 years ago, so it's not the types of, of updates that we would necessarily see today. But of course, there still is more that probably could be done to the house. For under $500,000, you can get a decent sized house with a pool here in Plano. And obviously we know Plano has a great school district, so if that's something that you're looking for, this might be the, a great, great neighborhood for you. Close to shops, close to dining, lots of businesses that I saw as I drove through here. All right, I'm gonna drive through the neighborhood, let you see what I see, and and then head on to house number two. I am walking up on house number two right now. So a couple things to note about this house is I am on Parker Road and Parker Road's a pretty, pretty busy road, lots of businesses here. But this house is actually on kind of like that main road or your main entrance into the neighborhood. But the street isn't that wide. So if you did have any friends over, traffic would have to go around them as they parked on the side of the street closest to your house. But I will show you the house behind me. There it is now, that ranch style house. Let me give you the stats on it. It is four bedrooms, two bathrooms, two car garage, 1,944 square feet. That garage has the rear alley access. So behind the house is where the garage is going to be. This house was built in 1973 and it is listed right smack dab on the average for sales price for Plano at $515,000. This neighborhood does not have an HOA, but you can tell that this house has, has been updated, updated flooring and tile, and you can tell that they've painted the original cabinets, which I'm sure looks a lot better than probably that wood color cabinets that were very popular in the 70s. As I've been on this road for a couple of minutes, there have been, there have been quite a few people that have, that have driven by, you know, 
maybe, maybe a little faster than they should have. Um, also, this house is in a school zone, and so right in front of the house, there is a sign that says you need to slow down for certain hours for school traffic. So I'm curious to know if parents picking up their kiddos, if there's going to be like a whole trail of cars in front of this house when it comes to be school pickup time. Part of the trend with you know some, some older homes is painting of the brick on the outside of the house. I'm not seeing that at all anywhere here in this neighborhood. People have kept the original brick, added some shutters, painted the door color, you know, things like that. Well, that's it for $515,000 here in Plano. And let's move on to house number three. <music> is listed at $525,000. It is four bedrooms, two bathrooms with a two car garage and it has a pool. It is 2,160 square feet. There it is behind me there. Red brick ranch style home. This is a very similar neighborhood than the other two neighborhoods that I have walked you through. This home was built in the 70s, and so what you're gonna find in Plano for right around $500,000, if it's a single family home, are going to be homes that are built in the 70s. This home has done a little bit of updates to it, just, just like the second home that I showed you. But again, not the whole house is going to be updated and renovated and things like that. You can kind of tell behind me, we've got a, quite a few cars behind me here because a roof, a house right there, a roof is, um, is getting replaced. I don't know what happened over there, no idea. But with these streets being so narrow, the mailman's having to kind of go in and out <laughs> to get to the mailboxes because there's a lot of cars on this street. So if you're looking for something that is more newer construction and single family in the $500,000 price range, then here in Plano, you're only going to find townhomes in that price range that are brand new construction or you know a year old maybe, but right around $500,000. But in this, in this price point here, you're gonna find homes that are, that are older in age with a little bit of updates, uh, may or may not have a pool. I was actually really pleasantly surprised that I was able to show you two homes with a pool in this price point in this area because Plano, like I said in the very beginning of the video, is very sought out, very sought out and a great place to live. If you are planning to relocate here from the DFW area or if you live here in DFW and need an agent to help you buy and or sell, I would love to help you out definitely reach out. My contact information is in the description below and I will catch you all next week.